risen. Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Risen with Tears of Gaia. Last time we tried to finish Master Illumar's quest and we're only one ingredient short of knowing all the ingredients to produce some scrolls. So last time I had no idea how to achieve this and then I thought maybe we should just run around and ask people whether or not they know of anything about that. So yeah, that's basically what we're gonna do today. And then we'll take on some other master's quests. So this is Ash. Hey, have you passed Master Illumar's test? Yes, he given it to you too. I found it exhausting. Exhausting? Yeah. Do you know the ingredients for the spells in the first circle? I did, but I can't remember. It was ages ago. You must remember something. I suppose I should remember them, but I was smoking quite a lot at that time. Come on, please think. I'm thinking, I'm thinking. No, I can't remember. But I got help from Master Abrax. Maybe you could. We've seen Master Abrax, and I don't know... I don't think he's helping us with this one. And I remembered. You remember why we got down here? To this library? Because we were looking for a book. That Rufus wanted us to get him. Alright, so we didn't find it, but we're gonna ask him anyway. Can you tell me the components for light healing? Of course. Many here are wary of strangers, but with the chaos going on, I say we're all in this together. I mean, you don't look like a spy, but spies don't, do they? Correct. It's for Master Illumar's test. That's why I need the ingredients. Ah. So you are certainly one of us. Well, you're working on it. I'm looking for wisdom in combat. If you'd be able to bring me that book, I'll tell you everything about the scrolls. Alright, so he insists on us getting him the book, and it wasn't in the library. So... So you might be thinking, heck, where is that book? But fear not, because of course I found out where it is. All we have to do is go somewhere we've never been before. To the cemetery, yeah. You didn't think this monastery would have a cemetery, but it has. And that's where they put my roommate for his final rest. And I want to visit him. There you are. So we've never been to this place. Let's walk into it. What? Yeah. I didn't think so. What's wrong with you? He won't let me past. Now he doesn't talk to me anymore. We didn't fight or something. Yoki, come on guy. So, I wanted to show you how to get inside of the cemetery. But apparently, this guy is just... Hmm. I'm watching you. You're watching me? Come on, tell me what to do! Okay. So, normally... So this is some kind of bug. Normally you would be able to talk to him. And then he would insist on having Mo Master Harlock's stew. Which is this one. Gives you plus two strength, so I wanna keep it, of course. Um... So, um... The other way to enter the cemetery would be... When you're... Continuing your investigation of the murder of Hemlar, then uh, you would distribute some Bruegel weed, and then you could give him a s some weed, and he would let you pass. But we're not at that point, and I want the book right now, so I figured we'd try some of the scrolls we already have. We could use a speed scroll and just run through here, but I think he'd follow us immediately, so we're gonna create an illusion. And notice how it says summon a skeleton, but that's not what's gonna happen here. It's gonna be a, a nice looking lady. And Yoki likes ladies. So we're gonna grab this apple here. Now he doesn't really care. Of course we have to sneak, or else he's gonna hear us. And follow us. So this is the cemetery. I did notice us. 
Come on, Yoki. Watch the illusion some more. Yes. That's what you got. It's not that easy. Alright, alright. I thought this would be... Easier. Now he's at it again. Yoki. Alright, so I'm not sure what we should, what we should do now. There must be a way in here. Maybe we can climb up here. No. But I was so sure that this was... St he still doesn't talk to us. So we're not gonna get in here like that. So we have to postpone this quest. I thought it might work, but it didn't. So, what are we on to now? This was Master Lumar's quest that we have not finished, but we will sometime. And now we have our. Um, this is Lumar. The test of the masters. Yeah, so I know what to do now. We have to go and talk to Master Abrax because last time he just wanted to get food. We have to talk to him one more time, and I think he'll give us a quest. What are you doing down here? Research. So, don't touch anything. I've got it all perfectly organized. Do you have to do your work down here? Alchemy is dangerous. It's not something you do in a crowded street. You don't want people juggling your elbow, or stealing your secrets. Besides, it's quiet down here. Most of the time. When I'm not here, you mean. Can I learn alchemy? Ha! <laughs> Young people, I want to learn centuries-old skills in an instant. <laughs> yes. It doesn't work like that. What not? Alchemy must be respected. It demands time, concentration, and skill. So there's nothing you can show me? I didn't say that. I can show you a few principles. But don't think you'll be able to start research and experimentation straight away. I don't care for research and experimentation. I just want to brew my own healing potions. That's all. May I buy potions from you? Yes, yes. I have an abundance of everything. Almost everything. Actually, my potion supply is very limited at the moment. I'm waiting for a new delivery of ingredients, you see. Oh, cool. I have to find a list of ingredients for Master Illumar's test. Can you help me? Ingredients? Is the old man experimenting with potions once more? I do hope not. He was never happy that he lacked my skill. Illumar should stick to scrolls. He's a master of those. <laughs> <laughs> Can you help me get the ingredients for his scrolls? Can I deal with a test set by Master Illumar? You're right to come to me. The scrolls and potions have some things in common. Both contain power which anyone can tap. All that is needed for either a scroll or a potion is the correct formula, the ingredients, and a little knowledge. Cool. Yes, and can you help me with the ingredients? <laughs> I was brewing potions when you were learning to crawl. Scrolls as well as potions? Uh, scrolls? Oh, yes. Yes, I once worked on a polymorph potion. I studied the illusion scroll for that, as I recall. I probably still have it here somewhere. <sighs> I know the ingredient for the illusion scroll is not the one I need. So he's not gonna be a big help for us, but let's find out what test he has. Will you set a test for me? A test? I have to seek each master and pass a test for them. Oh, well... I'm not really prepared. Let's see. Perhaps you could... No. What am I thinking? That's a bad idea. Bad idea or not, I have to take a test. Yes, but you also have to learn. Progressing up the order isn't everything. Testing and learning, the two aren't the same. I will learn. I will learn if you set me a test. Hmm. You don't have the right attitude. Test is there to stretch ability, shape knowledge. Hmm. An eagerness to simply pass is not appropriate.
Come on, shut up and give me the test already. What's wrong with you? Now will you set my test? I'm keen to learn more of the order. Hmm. First, we need to consider what you might be good at, eh? Whatever you set, I will do. Well, you have self-belief. Let's see if you have the skill, or maybe just the luck, to pass. Then what test do you suggest? Never have I met someone so keen to be tested. A test. I will give you a test. It won't require training, you don't have, but it could be dangerous. I sent two novices to bring me some plants. Specific plants. The novices have not returned. Your task is to find them and bring me the plants. That is your test. Searching for novices, how hard can it be? Searching yeah. for novices, how hard can that be? It is a test. If you doubt there is a challenge to it, then maybe you have failed it already. The two novices I sent failed to return. Or have you forgotten that? What do I do? What do I do when I find the novices? Send them to me and make sure you bring me the plants. Which plants do you need? I have a list of them for you. I don't suppose you could give me that list. Well, of course, of course. <laughs> now, where did I put it? Aha, here it is. All the plants I require. What are the novices called? What are the Why novices not? called? Sirius and, oh, what was it? Ah, yes, Craven. I sent them to the forest at the foot of the mountain. That's where I suggest you commence your search. So what can, what you, can teach you teach me? me? All right, some more mana and alchemy too. We're gonna save on that, maybe later. Let's, Let's trade. trade. He can sell us some potions first. Um, how much do we have? We have seven medium. Let's buy some more. Three medium, I think. And then three more small. Because why the hell not? <clears throat> yes. Alright, trade those and quit. And then again, um, sorry, we have to consume some stuff here. Wander lost. Because now we're heading outside again. As you might have be able to tell. Um, Alright, and then I want some more choice down here. A small healing potion too, a large healing potion. Then some fried meat and some, uh, yeah, that's about it. Whoa, so many apples. All right, let's eat them first before we get out of here. And also, um, there is one more monster who's going to send us out of the monastery anyhow. So let's go and talk to him first, get his quest, and then we'll, go, we'll be going outside and do the free quests. It's gonna be Master Abraxas quest you just heard about. Then there was Master Ignatius who sent us to acquire the fire crystal from uh, Recruit in the Ruins. And now we have to talk to Cyrus for one more quest. Do we need to get go outside? You! Yes, you. I've got a job for you. Tell Severin to send the next delivery. Got that? Severin? Who's he? Severin runs the artifact collection camp at a place known as Tilda's Farm. It's on the way from here to Harbour Town. Tell Severin to send the next batch of crates up here. I'll find Severin. If Severin has identified any special artifacts, he should give them to you. You bring them to me immediately. That's more like it. He jumps straight to the test. That's perfect. So... I can't leave the monastery. It's actually not true. I think we can. This guy's struggling with his crate. Hey! You could just walk around me like this. You have enough space here. Or you could just force yourself through here. I think he's gonna do it. He's gonna do it. He's gonna do it. Just a little bit more. Yeah. Yeah. Jerk it. Push it through here. Alright, so. Is there something we need to know? I can't leave the monastery. Well, you better make sure you can. I can now. I need to know the ingredients to make scrolls. Do you have a list of them? No. I expect you'll find something in the library. That would be cheating, anyway. 
Will Severin just, yeah. Will Severin just give me these objects? Why shouldn't he? He doesn't know who I am. Hmm. Perhaps you want a password to give him. The blackbird sang gently in the night. Beware a squirrel in your underrobe, something like that. That might work. Right. Tell him this. If you don't send the artifacts, I'll rip your head off. How about that? That sounds clear. Now enough. some more jiggling here. <laughs> some more jiggling. Recruit. Now is oh yeah, it is really narrow here. I'm sorry you guys. I made your job a little bit harder today. So, you wanna overview what quests were on here? Severin's artifacts. Um the test of Master Abrex. Brin's dangerous monsters, we're gonna do that too. Uh, Hemlar, no. The test of Master Vitus. This is the one, uh, wisdom in combat, so this is in the cemetery where we don't get there as of yet. The gate to the keep. Someday, Ignatius, Plains, yeah, Master Palace will open the gate for you, that's what he said. The Crystal of Fire is the next quest we're gonna do when we're outside, so we're on four quests right now for those four quests we need to go outside and that's what we're gonna do now first off is monster Vitus uh, no monster Ignatius no blah, blah, blah. yeah I think it was monster Ignatius's quest because there are those ruins I couldn't show you last time because it was night or evening and I'm gonna show them to you now I've advanced my training good training is vital I have here a list. This list names all those who has permission to leave the monastery recently. <clears throat> that will be a great help. Good. Then continue your investigation. No, nope. first I have to go outside. I'm allowed to leave the monastery. This is the word of Master Ignatius? Master Ignatius gives his permission. Then the gate shall be open to you from now onwards. I like how he just trusts me that it is the word of Master Ignatius. Some more rings to pull here. Can't pull them. Would have been a surprise to me, though. So, Santiago. You have nothing to say to me anymore. Bryn, we're gonna go and kill your dangerous monsters. With the bow, maybe. Maybe we'll lure them up here. It's a sly gnome. So, actually could have killed him from the arena. Which I found out last time. But it took so long with the bow. As you can see here. Not the best. Whoa. There you are. You, you sly gnome. Whoa. They're fast. I let, I let them hit me too many times. Oh, no, no, no. So we're just going to run here, let Bryn help us defeat his dangerous monsters. Bryn, you're not going to do anything? Careful! I'm not going to hack him to death here. Keep going! Yes, I am. Uh, loot the sons of bitches here. The other one ran away. And I saw there was a, a chest there. So I'm gonna go and loot the chest too. What chest are you guarding there? Excuse me, fella. There's an arrow stuck in your chest. Let me pull that out for you. Oh. Let me pull that out for you. Stupid sly gnome. Alright. Uh, rusty sword. Let's return to Bryn right away. Tell him what we did. Then go to the ruins. A ring of energy, that's cool, but we can't use it yet. Because, um. So there's another chest, some more monsters. There are the ruins. There's a war cricket waiting for us, as I know. And it's gonna be hard to defeat it. So I think it's gonna be the last thing we're, we'll do, be doing this episode. Oh, Bryn. I've dealt with your monsters. You have nothing to fear from the shadows anymore. Really? Those horrible things? You faced them? Yeah. They were... gnomes. Gnomes? Are you sure? They, they sounded a lot bigger. 
Well, there were a few of them. Listen, don't tell anyone about this. The boys will never let me hear the end of it. It'll be no meds in my bed for weeks. Sure. I won't say a thing. Thanks. You're a pal. Thank you. So he just gives me 25 gold. Oh yeah, let's fry some meat here. Now that we're at the fireplace. And I can tell you what happens next. So Looks good. next we're, we're gonna head to the ruins. And try to defeat the war cricket standing over there. And if we die, I think this is gonna be the end of this episode. Mm, uh, smells then I'll good. try to figure out how to kill it. If we don't die, then maybe we'll head into the ruins. So, yeah. And that will Looks be good. Master Ignatius's quest for the for the fire crystal. Because I I have um, the magic missile crystal. This is the one I was shooting for. But obviously I have to get him what he wants and not what I want. So. Just gonna try that. Alright, so maybe. Maybe we should do a quick save here. Auto save, yes. Continue. Quick save. I don't know, there, there is a hotkey for quick saving, but I don't know which one it is. So let's shoot some arrows at the war cricket here. Does not really hurt him. Yeah, that's not, that's not, it's too good. Oh no, that's a bad idea. Never. So gonna find out his pattern here. Yeah, fight him like any old human here. A charged shot and a quick shot. Charged, nope. He breaks his own pattern here and I'm dead. And I'm dead, so let's reload. This is like the second war cricket that killed us. And what did I tell you guys? If the war cricket's gonna kill us, then it's the end of the episode. So I'm loading for nothing here. Or should we take him on another time? One more try, one more try before we end this episode because somehow this really gets me riled up here. Come on, come on. I can't really hurt him like this. So, they apparently have an attack that drains all of your energy at once, like... When he does that, I don't know. Yes. With both hands, when he's attacking with both hands, then you have to watch out. Yes, was some kind of attack here. That happened here. So, one more please. I don't need more enemies attacking me, so... Ah, this is taking some time here. Yeah, yeah, now he's running circles. This is my strategy here, you're using. Ah, oh, that was a nice one. That was a nicer one. I think we're gonna take him now. Don't be too eager here. Alright. You have to be really wary about his attacks. He can kill you in one hit. Even though your health is full. Like this. Yeah. That was some kind of bad attack here. So I know that we should heal. But I don't want to run there. Healing, so all right so we're on here heal ah! yes one more like this and he's gone that would be the perfect end for this episode yeah we killed the war cricket and <laughs> I feel so alive oh my god all right so let's head into the ruins and this is like the perfect cliffhanger for the next episode. What awaits us in the ruins? We don't know. Thank you guys for watching and see you next time. So we finally 
get to go outside of the monastery, but life is dangerous there. There's gnomes, there's wolves, there's everything bad, and those ruins rising from the ground. To keep up to date, please subscribe! You made my day.